intelligence hype of 2023 is starting to have real-world effects in 2024. Major tech CEOs are doubling down their investments in AI. In January 2024, Meta CEO Mark Zuckerberg announced his plans to build an artificial general intelligence known as AGI. Hey everyone, today I am bringing Meta's two AI research efforts closer together to support our long-term goals of building general intelligence, open sourcing it responsibly, and making it available and useful to everyone in all of our daily lives. All this investment in creating AI jobs, but at the expense of others. The recent report from Indeed shows that the number of job posts containing Gen AI terms has been surging. The new growth strategy and where all the investment is going is to AI. I guess you can kind of just read the tea leaves, right? So if you're in tech, it's probably smart to get some AI experience or move into the space quickly as possible because that's where all the growth is. And that's where all the new jobs are going to be. Sentiment or takeaway here is simply this is where all the investment is going. Like I'll give you an example. I'll show you an example really quickly. All right, so let's talk about like how all this ties in, right? So Mark Zuckerberg saying they're investing in AI, right? Here's an example of the money being spent, right? The companies are spending billions of dollars on expensive chips and supercomputers necessary to train and build AI systems. By the end of the year, Meta uh, expects to have purchased 350,000 of these specialized chips from the chip maker NVIDIA, which costs an estimated um, 30,000 each. You can do the math, right? Uh, <laughs> that's a lot of money. The push into generative AI has coincided with cuts elsewhere. Google's layoffs reduced the number of people working on augmented reality technology. Meta, which laid off nearly 20,000 people last year, has been cutting some of its program managers who oversee different projects and are responsible for keeping teams on schedule. Basic takeaway there is relatively straightforward, which is investment is going from leveraging employees for growth and now is focused on building out AI strategy and using looking at AI business cases in order to continue on the growth path as well as maintain like profit profitability. Will it all work out? Who knows? But that's the new game that's being played. And if you're a tech CEO, you just have to play the game.